five-minute Bible devotions for children, stories from the Old Testament, helping our families. Miriam and baby Moses, Exodus 2, 1 through 10. In Egypt, a long, long time ago, a family had a little baby boy. They were happy, but they were also afraid. The evil king had told them that all babies' boys must be thrown into the Nile River. How could the family keep their baby safe? They made a special floating basket and put the baby inside. Then they hid the basket in the tall reeds by the river bank. The big sister Miriam said, I will watch the basket to make sure my baby brother is safe. Soon the princess came to the river bank. Walking along the water's edge, she spied the basket. Bring that to me, she told her helpers. They brought her basket and she opened it. Oh, look, it's a sweet baby boy. I will keep him as my own son and call him Moses. Just then Miriam came out of her hiding place. Princess, I'll know a lady who will take care of the baby until he is bigger, she said. The princess smiled at Miriam and said, that would be very good. So Miriam took little Moses home to his own mother and she took care of him. In families, we need to help each other. Mothers and fathers take care of their children, and brothers and sisters take care of each other and help their parents, too. God has put us in family so we aren't alone. It is one of the ways he shows his love for us. When we help each other, it makes everyone happy and pleases God, too. Let's talk to God. Thank you, God, for my family. Please help me to show my love to them by being helpful and kind. In Jesus' name, amen. What do you say? Okay, let's see. Who is being the helper in this picture? Emmett, can you see? Who's being the helper? Is this little boy feeding his baby sister? Isn't that nice? How did Miriam help her family? Do you remember? Listen, she was watching as the baby was put in a special ba basket. And then she said she will see that he's safe. And then she went to the princess, didn't she? And she said, I know a lady who will take care of the baby until he's bigger. And so she took the baby home to his mother and she took care of him. So she watched out for her baby brother, didn't she? What are some ways you help your family? Guess what Emmett did today? My three-year-old grandson, do you know what he did? He picked some raspberries, and he didn't like raspberries, but his one-year-old sister likes raspberries. So what did he do? Did he feed the raspberries to the baby? That was so kind. Yes, that was very helpful. I wonder if other children help as much as Emmett helped with his sister. Why do you think God wants us to be helpers in our family? Why do you think God wants us to be helpers? Is it a good thing to be a helper? Yes. Okay. What does God say? Always try to do good to each other and to nope. all people. First Thessalonians 5.15. God wants us to be kind one to another, doesn't he? And to be good. So, Lord, we pray that we will always be good to each other and to all people in Jesus' name.